good evening. Good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Mauricio. Hazel. Robert and Andres. Andres will be less, uh, like a listener today. Okay. Uh, what about you, Robert? Are you available today? Robert? I guess no. Okay. Well, welcome everyone. Good evening. Teacher. Good evening. How are you doing today? Right now, teacher, I have a little problem with my internet, but I can get a better, I get a better connection with the internet because it's raining here. It's raining. Okay. Well. Thank you so much for letting me know that information. Uh, Thanks. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Okay. It's okay. You uh, stay like a listener, and later on, if you can participate, you can do it, okay? Okay, good. Um, Let me share my screen. Just allow me a moment. Okay, we're we're going to wait a, a couple of minutes for the um other students to join us. Okay. Okay, today is the class nineteen. Okay. Um. How was your day? Tell me a little bit about your day today. Volunteers? Hello, teacher. Hi. This day, it was very tired because I I had a lot of, a lot of work in my, in my job. But right now, I am ready for, for the class, but I had a little problem with my internet because it's raining here. Okay. But I, I, I am ready right now. Okay, I understand. No problem. Well, okay, teacher, thanks. Thank you so much. Let me share my screen. Hi, lady. Hi, teacher. How are you doing? I'm uh, fine. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Everything is good today? Yes. Okay. I was in the office. Okay. It was raining a lot of day. Yeah. It was raining all day. All day. All day. Yes. Okay. And tomorrow will be your day off. So you are happy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Yes. <laughs> Very good. Who will work tomorrow? Guys, from you? Nobody? No one will work tomorrow? There are some companies that they, they double pay uh, the employees. But they, they don't give you free. They don't give you like a day off. Yes, Robert? Tomorrow uh, I have, I, I will have a day off because it is 15th of September. Mm -hmm. And I have a question. Uh, I, we will have class tomorrow. 
No. Gabe. <laughs> Thanks, teacher. You pee. <laughs> yeah. No, tomorrow we don't have classes. Okay. Okay. It... okay. Yes, you're, I guess, yeah, I, I saw a message that was sent. Okay, thanks. Mm -hmm. A message that was sent uh, to, to the group saying that we don't work today, right? Okay, what about you, uh, Gilberto? Are you going to work tomorrow? No. No, teacher. Okay. That will be good. And what are your plans? Tell it. Tell me what. What are your plans for tomorrow? Any plan? I stay home. Go to no, stay home. Okay. Uh, with, with my family, relax. Okay, good. That will be good. Okay, guys, let me share my screen. Where is it? Good. Well, today is Thursday, September 14, 2023. This is the class number 19. Okay. So, today we're going to have a review. Well, we're going to have a review about the vocabulary, and at the end, we're going to practice that. Okay. Uh, the main objective for this class is that you use the vocabulary learned in the unit three. Okay, good. So we're going to talk a little bit about crisis management. Discuss, uh, we're going to discuss about that. Okay. Um, like different issues that you may have in, in your company. Okay. Good. Let me use this link. We're going to discuss some questions about crisis management. Okay. Let me um spin it again. I need a volunteer. Volunteer for the first question. Any idea that you may have? No volunteers? Okay, I have, okay, I will call you, you one by one. Lady, you will be first. Okay, don't worry. Any idea that you may have, Um, you can tell me, okay? Has your company ever experienced a crisis? Yes, uh, in the pandemic. Okay, in the pan in the. Pandemic. It was in it was in two thousand, two thousand twenty, right? Two thousand, yeah, two thousand twenty, when the pandemic ar arrived to El Salvador. Okay. And how they handled that? Do you remember how they handled it? Yo no estaba todavía, pero the workshops. Uh... ¿Fueron virtuales los talleres o todas las actividades? Uh -huh. They changed the modality. Ajá, uh -huh. cambiaron la modalidad. Ok. Y de, uh, como un psicólogo daba atención personalizada a, a los empleados. 
I, I, I psychologists okay give uh, personal attention to all the employees okay good what else do you mm. remember that they told you lady Mm, only that. Only that? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Okay, Carlos, you are next. What are the some common costs okay, of a corporate crisis? In this case, a company, right? What are the common issues or the reasons why they um, face a crisis? Robert? Hello, teacher. Hello. Okay, in my opinion, respect about the question, what are some common causes of a corporate crisis? I remember in my company, they had a, a crisis in, in different, different time. For example, I remember uh, 10 years ago, and my company had a crisis because because the crisis the cell, crisis okay thanks teacher crisis uh, the company had they had crisis crisis uh, because um, the company don't don't sell the products and I remember the manager. Told everyone if um, any any employees like to to work for a uh, overtime is good, but uh, the, we 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 just not receive a uh, a uh, uh, pay for, for the hours. But I remember uh, all all employees is. Um, is agree with the decision in 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 my in my example i work for one hour overtime and and I, I like to i like to work because because my my job is very important this this is a uh, one example and example number two is the crisis for the company was when the pandemic in 2021 20, i think so 2020 uh, yeah Re really was very very difficult because because you know in the pandemic it was um, but difficult for every one company if for every one country and families however the company was very responsible with the employees because because he he always give the the pay for employees in, in i think i think this this was very very good about the decision of the company i remember this this is my opinion okay. about that good remember when you refer to a company is it okay it, it. okay thanks mm -hmm. teacher Okay, and remember what I told you about the verb agree, that you never use verb to be with the verb agree. You said all employees um, are agree. So all employees agree. Only, only agree. Only agree. Uh -huh. No, okay. no, no, ahí no va en de ninguna forma el verbo to be, okay? Okay, thanks for your advice advice clarification yes okay very good thank you so much okay, rodrigo you will be next
What can a business do when its sales are very low to avoid a crisis? What can a business do? Mm. Do you mean what other actions we do if the sales are low? Mm -hmm. That's right. Correct. What do you do if you have a business, right, that the sales are low? What do you do to avoid a crisis, economic crisis? Hmm. Well, in our case, uh, in, in pandemic, in pandemic time, uh, because we attend uh, so many industries, uh, paints, construction, plastics, etc. Uh, the all the all the paint area coatings uh, are very uh, go goes down, but the plastic. Uh, highs up about the double of the consumption so we we are we are the point the all, all the all the efforts may goes to the plastic area but in my case because i am a the purchase manager a, i i i i i'm i focused a, to all the all the purchase are uh, where go to where go where goes where uh -huh. going where goes where mm, mm, no porque no, pasado no. Eh, eh, where where goes I think or where go no no no, no, no. where went where went, went. where yeah. went eh, to uh, to all plas plastic area no you don't use where in that case just went all the purchases went to uh -huh. went to ah okay went to to plastic uh, all uh, focused uh, to plastic area oh, uh, okay. in uh, in the pandemic time uh, that's why the, the the all the sales uh, goes down in, in the coatings but there uh, hides up in the plastic area mm. oh. menos mal <laughs> menos mal because, oh, there, uh, because... there you so, have so... the compensation right the yeah, because all the people, well, in, in the company, all the people uh, do uh, did the uh, was in quarantine. No, sí, ajá, pero el 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 home office. Home oh, no. el, el, el famoso home office a la hora de hablar inglés no se me ocurre. Eh, <laughs> did did home, home office. And well, uh, as you know, was uh, critical times. All the people on in in the warehouse area uh, didn't do anything. But uh, when we had when we when we had a uh, all a uh, most to, to to do the all the. The delivery of the raw materials in that time uh, all the people in warehouse and and the and the people of i think transport or delivery i think uh, work those days but only those days okay was terrible right yeah it was terrible but thanking god uh, the the company the, did not uh, fire anyone. Wow. Oh, okay. Good. Quarantine. Repeat that. Uh. Quarantine. Quarantine. Me. Quarantine. quarantine. All of you. <laughs> ah. Quarantine. 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 Yes. Quarantine. Okay. Very good. Who the, who uh wants to be next? Another volunteer. Mm -hmm. Raise your hands. This, this was me resig resigned or resigned. Mm, resigned. Rex resigned. Yes, what's me in that word? Resigned is um 
For example, you are assigned to do on a specific uh, task, right? So when you are resigned, it, it means that, that you, you um, está resignado. Uh -huh. Resignado o reasignado? Resignado. So ah. in, this, in this case, it could be that you, when you, you accept to do uh, an, um, like Fire. An, an activity that you don't like, right? So, but you must but do you, it. But you accept it, you are resigned it. Uh -huh. Okay. Who wants to be next? Carlos, do you want to participate in this one? Uh, teacher, but I don't understand the idea. Uh... Okay. If the senior manager, do you know what is a senior, right? It's like a manager, mm -hmm. the big boss. Uh -huh. big box, right? Okay. If the senior manager in your company suddenly resigned, it, will you be there? Will be there a crisis? Okay. Um. O sea, se resignaría usted que en la company hubiera una crisis. Um, I don't know, teacher. It, it's like, uh, yes, for me it's good, but uh, my work or my job uh, is here. It's, it's, it's will the, be the, in, in, uh, uh huh, will be no, in, I don't in know. risk. Estaría en riesgo, right? Okay, let me spin the wheel. It, it, and Hello, let me see which which ans which question you have to uh discuss. That will be this one. Okay, volunteer to answer this. Why is important for employees to learn the the ropes of crisis management? Me teacher, I tried it. Okay. Okay. Uh, why is it? Uh, let me. Uh, the rope of crisis. A uh, rope is like a cuerda. Yes. Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, in this case, why is it important for employees uh, to learn the rope of crisis management? Uh, I consider it is necessary for the employees um, uh, to learn about the, the rough of crisis because okay. uh, when he uh, when they have uh that experience um they can uh afford solutions uh to the company uh and ev evitar they can avoid um uh, they, they can avoid uh Maybe, well, quizás no era evitar. Eh, because eh, with the, with this eh, notice, de mi pueblo, de conocimiento, eh, they can uh, handle the situation. Huh? Handle the situation or look for a solution. So okay, the they can handle the situation. Um, the company eh, don't stop. The company uh, is, is still working mm -hmm. with uh, employees with uh, that con ese conocimiento. No creería que por ahí iría la cosa. Entonces, para mí, perdón que lo diga en español, pero sí me estoy trabajando mucho. Para mí es necesario de que los empleados estén capacitados en relación a, a situaciones que podrían suceder en un futuro no lo llamemos ni lejano ni cercano, sino que incierto. O sea, es como, como estar preparados para cualquier imprevisto, pero es un conocimiento necesario que para mí tiene relación con, con el que estaba mencionando eh, previamente, eh, porque es necesario que la compañía continúe funcionando indistintamente de las, los fenómenos que se presenten en esto. Trataré de decirlo pronto en inglés todo eso. <risa> Okay, just just try try to to have uh simple ideas, okay? 
Um, uh, we were discussing yesterday that uh, try to think in in English, right? Right. Because if you continue thinking in Spanish, um, you have to translate, and it will be more difficult for you to find the words because you are translating. Okay, but if you try to think in English, okay, switch your mind, okay, in English, so you will you will find the words to connect the ideas. Maybe uh, not exactly the words that you want to, to express, but uh, you can, there are another way to, to express your ideas, okay? A veces quizás puede ser como, lo pueden hacer un poquito redundante o largo, okay? Your idea, but you will try to explain, okay? Um, okay. Your idea in English. Thinking okay. in English. I need to be I need to be honestly with you. Yeah. Uh, in the last model, um I can see at me uh an environment. Uh, yeah, um, an improvement. An improvement in my um uh, okay. pronunciation, uh, listening. Um uh, is is for me a uh, very grateful okay good uh, thank, you. thank you for all that okay i'm happy to to hear that okay. sure yes sure. i think that adversity are important to prepare employees for for crisis because uh in crisis all people we need to uh prepare the future uh, for example, study or or, or maybe uh or, or study at a diplomado, I don't know. And okay. English and another thing that to uh help them to uh looking for other opportunities or or in this case, but you stay in the company uh, only way for uh good good times and then the company increase your salary maybe and this moment that you have prepared to other uh, records teacher you prepare i'm sorry uh retos como se dice retos retos is a challenge Yes, yes, yes. And when we have a good time, uh, the people or employees, they will have prepared to a new challenge. Good, good. Well, what I what I think about knowledge, so knowledge never stops. So we are going to learn every day, okay? It doesn't matter if you have a bachelor degree, if you have a master degree, so you will still uh learn every day, okay? So uh believe me that I learn with you. I don't know everything, so I'm learning with you. Um if you read, if you take a course, of course, you will learn, you will have an um you will improve your knowledge. It's for example, you know you have a knowledge right now about whatever topic, but when you read or when you listen to experiences of someone else, um, uh, you relearn. Es como que aprendemos y luego reaprendemos. Okay, renovamos el conocimiento. So you never stop learning. In every in every single uh area, not only one specific area, but you will learn. You can learn on the street, in your job, um, every place that you go. You can take the benefits or the good uh good things from where you go. Okay, good. Sure. Yes, Carlos. Excuse me, what have you learned with this group or, or this team? What I have learned. Yes. From you. Yes. 
Yeah, a lot of patience. I imagine, <laughs> but. <laughs> no, no. We dis I like that we discuss different topics. And and I have learned of your, from your opinions. Uh, there are new vocabulary sometimes that you that I don't know and I unlearn with you. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Another question. Let me see. Another volunteer? Me, teacher. Okay, Gilberto. In what ways can social media pose a threat? to accompany reputation during a crisis? Uh, in my case, the comp my company, uh, one service that serve at, at the, at the customer for WhatsApp mm -hmm. and, and in we in in one occasion, if uh, uh, beside our uh, they claim the company, uh, the company no no I uh, no no working uh, no dejo de, no dejo de trabajar verdad nuestra compañía verdad. So you continue working uh, online. Sí, continue working online y en base person uh, at the customer or or country eh uh, uh, fue cuando I was more sell the products Fue cuando más vendimos nosotros, ¿verdad? Nuestros productos en la crisis de, de la pandemia, ¿verdad? Wow. And do you think that they, it was because people use your products to to treat the, the, the illnesses? Yes. Eh, the product is food. Uh, necessary the people uh, in 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 one occasion uh, for self uh, plan uh, three uh, plant uh, three necessary uh, Medicine. Medicine plants. Okay. Yeah. See, medicine okay. plant as uh, Dalinaza, the same, the same, and Fenogreco includes the cinema for tea, mm -hmm. the people were. Mm -hmm. Okay, I understand. A lot of people used to do different kind of teas uh, and they work I mean I consider yes. that was a good idea to treat the, the the illness like COVID with different kind of tea different product okay yes. I understand Gilberto thank you so much yes Carlos? I think that when I uh, the company they have uh, a lot of care with, uh, for example, when receipt feedback negative of the customer, or could be a, a controversial post and other the issues, that could be a problem with the reputation of the of the company. Oh, yes. That is true. Okay. Uh, Gilberto, you said Linasa, right? Do you remember how to say that in English? Yes. 
Linseed. No, teacher, no sé. Linseed. 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 Mm -hmm. Try to look for all, all the, the names of your products in English, okay? And you will know how to speak about your product, okay? Okay. Very Linseed. good. Linseed, yes. Okay. okay. Uh, let me see who else. Okay, what sort of person is good in a crisis? Mm -hmm. What sort of person is good in a crisis? It means like a, what kind of person, right, is good in a crisis? Crisis. Uh, what 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 do you mean, teacher? Uh, I think that uh is when a person is maybe to be honest or is. Uh, it is it refer, uh -huh, It refers to to the to the type of people, like uh, what kind of personalities? What okay. sort of what sort of person is good in a crisis? Do you know or any idea? Uh, the person the in a Christ teacher is um a creative creative a creative okay a creative um a motivation the the company okay motivated person uh -huh. motivated motivated person okay what else uh, um uh it's only teacher. Someone else? Any idea? Proactive and creative. Um, and no, proactive. Oh, proactive. Okay. Yes, proactive and with a uh, good communication. Good assertive communication. Yes. Mm -hmm. Teacher, people who like challenges. Ch okay, a challenge people person okay okay good very good and do you do you think do, do you have that kind of personalities how do you evaluate yourself lazy why <laughs> no, <laughs> no. <laughs> Yeah, so, uh, maybe somehow, I was lazy. Yes. Um, because... Somehow we are lazy, right? Somehow, but um, uh, it is it, it is difficult when you have to travel maybe a lot from your house to your work. That is, I consider that is like. A, the time that we lost, the valuable time that we lost, right? Just traveling from one place to another. Um, what else? Maybe when I lost the, the time that you have uh, time that, that don't to do. I'm sorry, can you repeat that? Uh, when you... Uh, I don't know. Spend the time with team that you don't that, that you don't that, like. That's some, yes, that, yes, of course. That you don't like to do. Aha, uh -huh. yes. Uh it happens too when you don't enjoy what you are doing. Um. Uh, so you don't you don't feel uh satisfaction yes. of what you of what of what you are doing, and that make make you lazy like uh, you don't want to do it right but if you are not organized also it happens you need to be a really organized person in order you can have um like in order you can succeed right in this life and have uh, like a better opportunities or you look, look for the new opportunities to improve every day Size the time. Mm -hmm. 
if you are organized, you, you look for strategies that help you to save your time, right? Um, you have time to, to do exercise, to study, to work, to share with your family, um, to go, to go out, right? And maybe travel if you like to do that. Well, teacher, but... I was listening, I was listening mm -hmm. in Facebook that, uh, someone said, uh, uh, all people we need to um, project in, in, in 10 years. Goals. It's ten, goals 10 years, all people we need to uh, project it. But, uh, si ¿sí, no? ¿Cómo le digo si ¿sí, no? Mm. O sea, lo que le quiero decir si no, eh, es tiempo perdido. Si proyectamos a 10 años y no lo aprovechas, is is we lost time mm -hmm. if you it, okay if you have goals for 10 years it, from now to 10 years if you don't reach then okay mm -hmm. you you feel that that you have been losing your time okay yes yes that you lost your time yes. uh -huh. it happens yes it, it could be Yes, for because uh, the the people have ten years old and lost ten years, and this woman have forty and and, and believe, believe me, the time is running very fast. Yes, of course. Yeah, if you don't take advantages, guys, mm, the ones that are before now, the ones that are that uh, are before their thirties, take advantage of your age. Okay. And do productive things because once that you are forty, <laughs> it will be more difficult. I don't have, I don't, I, I mean, I am not forty, okay, um, uh, not forty years old yet, but around, almost, almost <laughs> around. <laughs> okay, I don't like to to talk about that. Sure. Yes. In this case, uh, what sort of person is good in a crisis? Uh, I consider uh, in a crisis it is necessary. Crisis. 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 Mm -hmm. It's necessary uh, to come with a person and with ability to adapt to the to the change. Mm -hmm. um, it's necessary uh, to come with a uh, person that uh, can see the the better side of a by of a bad situation. Uh, uh, can see the opportunity in the chaos. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Okay, let me see what is the other one. What role do communication and transparency play in manage, managing a corporate crisis? Uh -huh. We were speaking that communication skill is really important, right? So in this case, it's asking what role do communication and transparency? Uh -huh. Someone? Opinions? Me? Again? Okay. Um, the communication is uh, and transference is, is very necessary uh, because we need to express the truth about the situation. It's bad situation, okay, uh, good, but we need to express uh, the truth of the situation uh, because uh, the employees uh, can uh, can uh, aport artists. They can, can bring. Bring can bring ideas. Uh, can bring ideas. Um, uh, about we can uh, uh, up, we can affront the situation. Um, and get um uh, results that can. No sé. Mejorar that can improve. 
improve the situation of that company. Mm -hmm. But the idea, the principal idea is uh, uh, be honest and mm -hmm. say the truth. Um, por, porque es un problema que hay que afrontar y, y ya. Correct. Okay. Yes. Uh, communication and transparency is really important, right? Um, because all the the community in the company, I say I say community, but but I means all the employees, right? The employees community, uh, will will be aware about what is happening. What is happening? Okay, am I continue working here or not? Um. If they will receive the same salary or not, because a lot of companies they reduce the salary to their employees, right? Uh, because of the 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 pandemic, um, they were not able to support or to to pay the salary they were they, that they were paying because the the business was having a crisis, right? So a lot of employees they had to accept to to have less money, right? Um, but they have to communicate the employees. Okay, that will be the new the new salary that you will get if you agree with that. So you can accept it, or uh, they could go. But if the situation was not good, um. In the company, imagine to looking for another job. A lot of employees they have to accept um, to receive a low salary. That was really difficult. Half teacher. I'm sorry. Half salary. High salary or low salary? La mitad. Half. 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 Mm, probably not the half, but. Oh. Maybe um, I remember, I remember one um uh, one of my friend, she was working, I I I'm not mentioning the the name of the company, but she was earning around eight hundred dollars, and from that time the crisis time, she the salary decreased to five five hundred. Oh really. Mm hmm. The 900 to... From 800 to 500, yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay. Because of the time, we're going to stop here, these, these questions, but they, they are really good. So do you remember, guys, um, that we have a pending... We have a pending activity? Who is ready? Mm -hmm. Do you remember the activity? Let me um not teacher. I uh, yesterday we have a problem with my uh my techo. <laughs> okay, let me I have look. a I have a leak. Oh, you didn't work, right? No, yet, teacher. Okay. It was about. Let me see. I don't know. It was about this. Discuss one of these situation, and you are going to choose. Uh, you are going to provide your ideas to solve one problem of this. And the groups that I have are here. I remember that only one group presented yesterday, and the other group is the other groups are pending. Teacher, may I show the the screen that that homework? Okay. Please. Let me uh give you access to share your screen. Okay, you can do it now. 
So, Carlos, did you work with Silvia and Sofia, right? Uh, yes, in theory. Okay, but, but uh, you I didn't finish? Say. No, teacher, no. No. Mm, okay, I have no, other things. no problem. So, in that case, we're going to leave that activity for next, mm, next Monday because tomorrow we don't have classes. Uh, the other groups, I don't know if you are ready. Please let me know. If not, we're going to to do it on Monday. Teacher, this no, call teacher. when we finish. I'm sorry? Uh, excuse me. Uh, when we finish this course? We're going to have a, let me see. Today is 14, right? Yes. So we don't have classes yes. tomorrow, and then we're going to have classes next week. That will be 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. And then we're going to finish the course uh, on Monday 25th. Because uh, we have five weeks for this course. For all the intermediate courses, you have five weeks. Ah, uh, oh, okay. okay. Mm -hmm. It is now just four, like the basic. Ah, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, if you are not ready, we're going to give, we're going to uh, present these ideas on Monday, okay? And we're going to continue with the rest of the no, other. Teacher. Are Thank you teacher. ready? Yes, Robert? teacher. Uh, i ready with Rolando. I remember yesterday I I had activity about five problems and we we get to to a solution about one two or more problems. Is okay. correct? Yes. If you have a, a presentation, you can share. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay Orlando, are you ready? Yes, yes, I am ready. Okay, teacher, we are ready for, for the presentation. Okay, present it, please. Okay, uh, give me a moment, please. Okay, can you see the the image? Yes. Okay, uh, uh, good evening everyone. We are talking about the solution about the problem in, in a restaurant. My team, Rolando and I, uh, we, are, we are talking about the 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 restaurant R and R, Rolando and Robert restaurant, mm -hmm. and the 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 problem number one. Money has the had disappeared from the register machine, but I can't tell who is taking it. Uh, we are talking about with Rolando, what, what is the solution about the problem? But Rolando told me, if I a cashier, I don't, I don't pay the money. And I agree with, the, with, with him. And he told me, if I, I am the boss, I don't, I don't pay the money. And and he 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 had a a reason because uh, it's it's a problem with the money. For that reason, I think in in the following solution. And um, when if if I if I had a problem similar with with number one. The solution about that is the following. Uh, number A, uh, 
meeting staff to report the problem. This is a, a sol I, I, uh, we are thinking this is a solution. Uh, mm -hmm. Meeting a staff to report the problem. Yeah. And okay. B, B, reach in agreement to pay the missing money. And C, let them know what we must work as a team. This is very important at the at the company work as a team in different situation. Yeah. Uh, for that reason, uh, we are we are talking about about the solution. And with the number two, right now is Rolando continue talking about that. Are you ready, Rolando? Rolando. Okay, I, I I am continuing with with the presentation because I, I think Rolando he he has a problem with the internet or audio. I think. Oh, okay. And number two, someone brought three bottles of the best wine in the restaurant, but none on the service has reported that the issue. I think this is a this is a big problem because he he employs is a waitress he is suddenly he he found broke three bottles of wine. This is this is a big problem for, for the employees in and for the for the boss, I think. For that reason, uh, we are talking about the following the following solution. Um, number A, meeting a staff to report the problem. It's very important the employees uh, to know about the about the problem in the company or the different situation. And B may a call for attention to the person responsible to be honest and say that he did it this is a a, a good a good decision i think when i i had a mistake different mistake at the company in the family and different in different places is is good decision be honest because this is this is good Mm -hmm. Yeah. And for that reason, A and B may I call for the attention to the person responsible to be honest and say that he did it. And, and number C, when a person is honest, has a thing we can help them. Um the this answer is important too because when 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 the person uh i think may a mistake but the person is honest and and he or she says i i did a mistake is 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 a is a very good decision yeah for that reason is number c is very important when a person is honest as a thing we can help them yeah and and this is the this is the answer about the the one and two problem in this situation thanks teacher okay good good so just have a couple of observations so you said we are we are think so in this case it's not necessary the verb to be okay just we think Okay, nosotros pensamos, okay. Just we think. Just we think, uh-huh. Okay, okay. Okay. Um, okay, and the other one is, when you said make a call for attention, that will be make a call in attention, okay? Call in attention means llamada de atención. Okay, may, may a calling, calling. Call in attention. Mm -hmm. Calling attention, okay. To the person responsible. Okay. Okay, well, good. Thank you so much for your um, 
ideas to resolve the problems. Okay, thanks, teacher. Okay, good. Okay, another uh, group. Okay, if you're not ready, don't worry. We're going to do that on Monday. We're going to continue now. Just let me share my screen. Okay. Okay. The question says, how would you define an inadequate crisis management plan? Okay, cool. Could a lack of communication cause a crisis management plan to fail in mitigating the financial loss? We were speaking about that in the previous activity in the questions that we have, right? So why communication is really important in a company. Uh, in this case, the question is, could a lack of communication cause a crisis management plan to fail in mitigating the financial loss? Uh -huh. What is your opinion, someone? Nobody? In my opinion, teacher, about question number one, how would you define in, in a quiet crisis management plan? I think it's when, when the company don't, don't have a plan for for resolve the, the crisis, this, this is this is bad. This is my answer about question number one. Okay. Inadequate. Okay. Inadequate. Okay. Inadequate. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. That is your answer for question number one. I guess it will be uh no good at all for employees, right? And for the for the company either because they will lost a lot of money. Okay, someone else. The no. Chair, yes, Carlos. I think that uh, question two uh, could be is necessary uh, and important to uh, the communication in the company because uh, the um, manager used the communication for a uh, take decision and in the end. So uh, that's reason avoid to financial loss. Okay. Yes. Very good. Good opinion. Thank you so much. Someone else? Okay, if we don't have more opinions, so we're going to continue. We have a reading here. This reading um it has, let me see, like three paragraphs. I will give you Five minutes to read it. Please read it and then I will ask you some questions. Also, you have it in your in your file, okay? Teacher, what means surveillance? Aha, uh -huh. that is the first question. Surveillance. Surveillance. Okay. Surveillance. So in this case is um 
it has to do with the technology, right? It says read the following passage about surveillance surveillance technology. So in this case, it's like a close observation, okay? When you have to study something, It's like a vigilancia. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's related to um, a cameras of security. It could be, it is related. Okay. Hmm. Uh, es lectura, teacher. Yes, please read it. And I will ask some questions for you. Did you what's mean is spooky? Spooky is uh when you feel fear, cuando siente miedo, okay? Okay. Or reassuring, reassuring. Mm -hmm. What is reassuring? Reassuring. Reassuring is when someone intends to remove someone's fears. Cuando alguien te ayuda a que se, quite, se te quite el miedo, okay? Reassuring. Okay. Reassuring. Reassuring. Mm -hmm. Reassuring. <laughs> okay, if you want, we are going to read it together. Okay, it says, both of the public discussion of this surveillance technology, and it's just re revolve revolve this around the question. Is it spooky or reassuring? But a different issue is the effect of surveillance on behavior. And a new research paper shows in detail how significant the surveillance effect can be. The researchers measured the impact of software that monitors employee level death and sales transactions before and after the technology was installed a 392 restaurant in 39 states employees theft and fraud a big is a big problem estimated at up to two, 200 billion of years across the economy most of the restaurant industry pays Pay its serves low wage, and they depend on tips. Employees' replacement and high, is high. Okay, in the environment, a certain amount of of tip has long been regarded as a normal part of the business. A simple example is bartender. No charging for a round of a drink and urging the customers to take care of me with a large tip. Other tactics are more elaborate. By monitoring software is now available to track all transactions and detect suspicious patterns after the installation of the monitoring software. Income, income per restaurant increase by an average of 2,982 a week. Knowing they were being monitored, mm -hmm. the service not only pulled back of any unethical practices, but also channeled their effort into, say, prompting customers to have that 
desserts of of second beer. Aha. What is your opinion about this passage? What comes to your mind, the main idea of the paragraph? Sure. I think that there are many teeth in the restaurant area. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And still, we have, all right? But uh, now it's, it's left than, than, than before, right? Because uh, if they know they, have, they are observed, by someone, so they need to to um, to take like um precautions because they know if they if they are discovered, they will be fired, right? Uh huh. What is your opinion about customers or employees in a company? When they know they 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 are monitored by a camera, how change their their behaviors? Well, in the in the case of the employees, as we know, as we know that we are uh, monitoring, uh, in that case, uh, we uh, we know that that. We have to do our work the best, uh, the to apply all all our effort to make and to to conquer all the all the objectives. And in the case of the customer or clients who visits like a restaurant or something, uh, they feel very comfortable. They feel uh, secure. And they have all the confidence that anything happens in the place. They can, uh, they can, uh, they they can have the as a uh, they can have to receive any support or assist in for the for the place like the security or I don't know maybe. If something that I uh, that I that they don't like it, they can uh, re, uh, have uh, some assist with the manager or something. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. But also, uh, there are some uh customers in in big stores, right? They probably uh used to be teeth. Long time ago, when when they <laughs> when cameras were no um invented yet, mm -hmm. but now they they know also that there are cameras for everywhere, so they need to be careful with that. Yeah, when the item hiding down the when the they see something and hide the article in the inside the the pantalon i don't know uh-huh <laughs> <laughs> they used to do that yes and they always hide into camera mm -hmm. difficult right For... yeah but teacher this bomb is very bigger is very uh exorbitant what is bigger i'm sorry uh, the employee thieves and fraud, it, it is a big problem. It's oh. debated up to 200 billion a year. Yes. It's and a big now, problem. And, and now has increased uh, virtually. So I receive a lot of messages from, supposedly <laughs> the messages are from the bank saying that, ah, your account has been blocked. Um, uh, to reactivate your account, please click here. Ah, okay. And you know that they, they, that is fraud, right? They want to put clip on the on the link. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Correct. That yeah. is that is phishing. Yes, correct. That is 
sufficient and you have to well report or just delete it i'll just ignore them or delete it because i know um and not only one message i receive a lot of messages from different really <laughs> yes be careful with that because uh nowadays it is really hard so there are a lot of uh tech or how do you call the people who know a lot of technology? Hacker. Hackers. 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 Uh huh. And then you receive a message that says you have won a car, a uh, uh, a nice pickup highly. Yeah. And you <laughs> <laughs> and you put click here and then you won. Introduce your credit card or debit card information. Yes, of course. You had yeah. to you had to pay a five hundred dollars to receive the the, the price. <laughs> yes, of course. It's a okay. model two thousand twenty three. Mm hmm. <laughs> crazy, crazy. Yes. Okay, good. We're going to to continue. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, we're going to discuss these questions. We have six questions here. Why do people think surveillance is considered spooky? Uh, maybe the, the people feels... Uh, observe. Yes, observe. Don't like to observe. Maybe I just... That's reason they have spoken mm -hmm. okay yes right but nowadays they don't have to feel uh that because there are cameras everywhere and we are controlled uh what i think is that we are controlled everything that we that we have in our cell phones is controlled by you know someone else um teacher mm -hmm. uh, because uh can uh the privacy of the people the privacy oh yes yeah, they yeah. they can argue with that right that they don't have privacy uh-huh and but if you go to a store or any place right they have to that that they have to pro protect the the business right the company they it's have, necessary to it's serve nece others. It's necessary, yes. Okay, um, second question. How many restaurants were part of the research according to the reading? How many uh, restaurants? Three hundred, uh, three hundred ninety-two restaurants. Uh -huh. three hundred ninety-two restaurants in thirty-nine states. Okay, very good. Good reading strategies. Okay. Um, what is the estimated cost of employee TF and fraud? Two hundred billion dollar. Two hundred billion a year. Mm -hmm. Wow, a lot of money. Okay. What is fraud tactic used by bartenders? Uh, no charging uh, for a round of drinks. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. No charging for a round of drinks. Uh -huh. What do you mean? The, the customer to take care of uh, mm, Eh, eso ya no. With a large tip, okay. They don't they don't charge the customers, but they they request like a large tip. Okay, una propina grande. Okay, ah, uh, ajá. Uh -huh. So it means like, that, ajá, uh -huh, Carlos. Uh, I don't I don't get it. This uh this paragraph. Okay, uh, it says. For example, I I am bartender and. I serve you uh, uh, maybe a couple drinks or beverage, mm -hmm. but I don't charge you. The first, you. 
the first round. Okay, and then what happened? So, for example, uh, maybe he, that is a tactic that they used, right, in order they could receive a tip. They can say, so the first round will be for free, uh -huh, and then you pay the rest. So it means that they, they are um, uh, given the product for free, right? But they don't pay anything for that product, uh, the, the bartender. But the, the money will be for the bartender, no for the business, because um, they are giving a product for free for for um, for the clients, and the clients would feel like, oh, he's a good person, he's a good bartender. I'm going to give him a, a large tip, right? Uh, es como que no les cobro, pero a mí me dan el dinero bajo la mesa, algo así. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Like that is a tactic that they use, right? Uh, and they don't the even though they don't have permissions from the from the manager to do that, but they do it because of that is the tactic. Okay. Mm -hmm. Who is lost in there? The company, right? Okay, good. Uh let me see the other equation. What was the increase of income after the installation of monitoring software? All the revenue of the of the restaurant. Mm -hmm. Almost three thousand dollars per week. Almost three thousand dollars per week. Yeah, that was big. Okay, and the last one says. What was the ch the change in behavior in the staff after the mon monitoring software was installed? How they change? Sorry. Uh, may I repeat, teacher, please, the okay. question? The attitude of of the staff that was observed, okay? Que era observado, monitoreado. Uh, how they they, they, well, they, uh, first of all, they, they understand that they cannot, uh, they cannot, uh, Probar. They cannot. They cannot. They cannot be a thief. Uh huh. Uh, be a thief, and also they understand it uh, to do the best of the, on the on their uh, task, and I don't know maybe combine any aptitude or effort in order to be much more a uh, a uh, productive a uh, productive person mm -hmm. good okay el verbo robar es steal okay steal S yeah steal. Steal. Mm -hmm. that is a mm -hmm. verb steal. they can mm -hmm. steal. Ste they can always steal from the company and mm -hmm. Tiff es, es ladrón. Es ladrón. Ah, es el mañoso. Ajá. Ladronear. No vaya a ladronear más. Es cabal. Yes. El tip. Tiff. Ok. Good. Why, teacher, why, 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 why some people the name Tiff and some other theft? What is the difference? Tiff and theft. Okay, let me double check. Oh, you mean the pronunciation of that word, right? Some, uh, uh, uh huh, but some, theft. Uh, in the theft, uh huh. Some people write theft and other people thief. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me just to make sure that the spelling is. Ahiris T H E F. 
theft. Mm -hmm. No, yeah. Theft. It is like la pronunciación is 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 weird of this this word because uh, uh we said thief, uh huh? It is it, we can understand that, but also it's like a theft. Mm -hmm. Theft. Look, listen to this. Theft. Theft. Yes. Theft. Let me see. Thief and theft is the same thing, teacher. It is the same. Oh, okay. Mm. Yeah. Well, uh, uh huh. In other means, uh, I, 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 the first time I, I learned the, the, the word like a thief. Mm -hmm. But uh, on this... these times, maybe uh, in some, in some. Uh, the, the spelling is different, okay? Mm -hmm. because, because thief is uh, T H I E F. Thief. 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 Okay. I, I, I uh, confuse the word, and you are right. So this one is tough, okay? Mm -hmm. But it's the same. And thief. Thief. Is thief. Mm -hmm. T H I E F. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But is the thief is the person I think or the ladron. The but thief what is if the person correct? But what is theft? It is also person or, is, or what? It is also person. Yes. But I think the the, the two are correct. Two are correct. Yes. Ah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Like I think, like uh, like when you say the first time I I learned it, oh, zero no. zero. Oh no. oh no! I'm sorry. I I having a confusion. Okay, one is steal is robar. Okay. Mm -hmm. te yes. Theft. Theft. The one that you can see here is es robo. Robo como noun como nombre. Employee theft. Es un robo, ¿ok? Ok. Y Tiff con... El ladrón. Es el ladrón. Ajá. Es el sujeto. Correct. Ah, ok. That is the difference. But this is not a verb, it's a noun, ¿ok? El verbo es steal. Steal, ok. Yes. Ok. Mm. That, that, that's much clearer for, for yes. me now. Yes. Thank you so much for the observation because um, in my mind it was Tiff, <laughs> ¿ok? But it's no, teacher, no. no, teacher, you lost one point. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but yes, the spelling is different. You are right. That is, it has a letter, tiene una I antes de la E, cuando es un, mm -hmm. un ladrón. Okay, mm -hmm. teacher, when, when, that, when I say thief, is a person that is robbery thieves. Mm -hmm. Un ladrón, thief. Okay, okay, and when I say es un es, robo. Es un robo. Uh -huh. and, when, and when you said steal, es, un, es robar el verbo. O sea, uno es el sujeto, el, no, el otro es como el nombre de la acción y el otro es el verbo de la acción. Correct. Algo así sería. Ah, yes, you, okay. you, are, you are right. That is exactly. Okay. One, is the, one is the subject, the other is the action, as you said. And mm -hmm. the other, the other is, is the verb. Is the verb. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. I got, it. I got it. Thank you. Correct. Thief. Remember, thief is the is the subject. Okay. Okay. But it it is without t, just is with the f, but it has a i between h and and e. That is thief. And yes, and this one it is. Theft. It is. It, it, es como no es como t, sino es como una f. theft. Como una z. Uh, sounds like that. Theft. Theft. Okay. Theft. And the other one, the verb. It is s t e a l. Steal. Okay. 
steel. Uh, this vocabulary you say hierro. I confused with the steel. Hierro. Hierro, mm. o, 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 o no sé si, si, si me capta la idea, pero déjenme ver. Steel es acero, hierro, iron, creo. Ajá. Ah, ok. Hierro eh. es iron. Ok, entonces no, es otra la palabra. ¿eh? Okay. Acero y acero. Steel. Steel. Mm, creo. Let me, Entonces, look, let me double check the spelling. Acero, acero es steel. Steel. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Steel. It, it, sounds, it sounds very, very similar. Similar, yes. But, but uh, if you write it, steel, uh, steel de, de robar. Es S T E E L y estilo de acero es S S T E A L. Correct. Mm. There okay. you have it. I think I think I will steal the steel, but <laughs> <laughs> well, you can say you can uh do a, a long uh thought twister with that, right? <laughs> yes, yes, I yeah. still steal. Correct. In in yeah. TikTok and. En TikTok hay, hay un usuario es peruano que está casado con una gringuita y ellos hacen una serie, eh, hacen varios videos de varias cosas, pero ellos hacen a veces una dinámica donde él le pregunta a ella, porque es la esposa, que, eh, ¿cómo se dice tal cosa? ¿Y cómo se dice tal cosa? ¿Y cómo se dice? O sea, varias palabras que suenan casi igual. Entonces te lo, te lo hace hasta como trabalengua. Correct. You are right. Y al final pro... casi todas son igual. ¿no? Ajá, yes. o sea, es, es como la pronunciación y quizás como el acento donde las vas diferenciando. Y, sí, y quizás la misma, la misma oración o la conversación te hace, te hace suponer, ah, está hablando de esto. De tal cosa. Café? Yeah, the context. Uh, you you understand ah, context, it by the, the context. context. Exactly. Okay, these words are exactly the same, the pronunciation, okay, and the meaning is different, and the spelling is different because yes. both of both of them are steel. Steel. Okay. Steel the steel. Mm -hmm. Steel. Steel. Yeah, both, steel. Are, both are the same. Okay, very good. Good observation and clarification the, about this, this pronunciation and spelling, oh, yes. of course. Oh, yes. That is why I told you I learned with you, okay? <laughs> <laughs> okay, Disha. Every okay. day we learn. Yes, and, and I like it. I mean, I don't feel bad if you, t if you tell me... Uh, that is an observation, okay? If you have a doubt with that, just let me know, okay? Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, good. So now we are going to have a, a, a building vocabulary here with the different uh, words that we found in the, in the reading, okay? So do you remember all of them? If we don't remember, if you don't remember all of them, so we can check. Okay, so I will give you mm -hmm, two minutes to double check the meaning of them. Okay. <clears throat> I have here. Ha, huh, good. Let me take the. Tengo la flechita. Okay. Okay. Number one it says surveillance. Do you remember the meaning of this? In the act of watching. 
someone closely to detect a crime. Mm -hmm. Good. Vigilancy. Mm -hmm. To act or watching someone closely to detect a crime. Okay, good. Reassure. The way someone acts, maybe. Oh, no, no, no. Um, to remove someone's doubt and fear. Mm -hmm. Good. Yes. To remove someone's <laughs> doubts or, or fears. Okay. Behavior. The way someone acts. Yeah. This one, yes. Okay. Tell. The action of or crime of stealing. Mm -hmm. Very good. Ah, okay. Now, yes. Makes sense. Makes sense. Yes, that is the action. Okay, gue uh, that is wave. Way, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Wave. Way. Wage. Let me the see. The amount of money paid out to an employee. Yeah, it is waged. Waged. Um, yeah, it is the amount of money pay to an employee. Very good. This is payroll, teacher. Mm, payroll. Uh -huh. mm, yeah, similar with payroll. Similar. Yes. O sea, es la quincena la que le está pagando. Yes, the amount of money paid to an employee. It could be the... Uh, it could be when we... Similar. It could be one week or two weeks, uh, any time, right? But the it is the amount that you that someone pay the company pay to an employee. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Tip. And to give a small amount of money <laughs> to someone who has provided a service. Very good. Okay. Spooky. Okay. Um, Something that causes fear and nervousness is spooky. Oh, sorry, sorry. You're right. Is is this one? Gran trifachuca es. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Did you get it? Yeah. Yes. It is so. It is something that causes fear or nervousness. Okay. Good. Good. Very good. Do you have questions about that? Spooky. Sp yeah, uh, spooky. That is a spooky. Tips, teacher? What? Tip? What's the name, tips? It's to give a small amount of money to someone who has provided a service. For example, if you go to a restaurant, mm -hmm. um, and you receive a good service and you decide to give uh, five dollars to the to the waitress because the service that she provided to you is like a propina mm -hmm. it is okay tip yes i think that tip is like a, a advice <laughs> mm, no or or treats i don't know no tips Tips with the ah, S. Tips. Ah, yeah, okay. it, yeah, that is different. Yes. Tip. This tips. is tip. This is tip. Tip. Oh, okay. Tip. Okay. Very good. We are going to move on. Now we are going to write a paragraph to say whether you are in favor or against employee surveillance at your workplace. Okay, state at least three reasons to support your position. If you are in favor, si está a favor o en contra. Okay, that employee surveillance of your positions. Okay, está en contra o a favor que lo vigilen en su trabajo. Okay. I'm going to... Let me just, I need to 
type the activity. Try to think in ideas. I'm going to send you the link in the chat. Just allow me a moment. There you have it. Right, ten line paragraph to say whether you are in favor or against. surveillance at your workplace. State at least the reasons to support your position. Okay, there you have the chat in the in Zoom. And I will send that also by WhatsApp. There you have the chat in the WhatsApp too. I will give you seven, twelve minutes from now to write the paragraph. We're going to finish at nine fifty-five. In order we can work in the in the homework, okay? Vamos a, a trabajar hasta las y cincuenta y cinco y luego pasamos a hacer la tarea.
Carlos. Or that is for everybody. Uh, please provide a brief introduction of your points if you are in favor or against. Okay. It's bad that you put in the the dashboard. I mean, it it is good, but just just write a a brief introduction. Escriba una breve introducción de que si usted está a favor o en contra. And then you say the fall. I am in favor because I think this and this, and the three reasons are this okay and then you write the three reasons oh, okay Okay, very good, very good. It is some confused, the point. It is confused for you, Rodrigo. Is Are you in no favor, <laughs> no against? So you are neutral. Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're going to we're going to review all of them tomorrow. Thank you so thank you so much for the one that are participated. Okay.
Guys, for the one that are that are as a listener today, I hope that you are listening this. Please try to work on this activity. If you don't do it right now because you are busy, do it later on. Okay. But for Monday, we're going to to read all of them. Okay. Remember the more you practice. More you improve your your learning skills, your English skills, not only um the speaking, right? It is necessary also to develop your writing a skill, reading a skill, um listening a skill. Okay. Good. Four minutes extra. For the ones that are free, you can start working on the on the um, section three homework. Let me see which homework is three point seven. It it has exactly the the vocabulary that we have been reviewing. Okay, it, it, it is about re reassure, behavior, okay, path, waste, okay, spooky. spooky. Two more minutes for, for the one that are typing, or you can complete it uh, after the class, no problem. Hey, sure. Yes, Carlos. Excuse me. Uh, the call center, how they measure the person, uh, percentage of thing. What do you mean? How they Me measure? Uh, or sorry, measure. 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 measure the person type of English. They right. they says uh we need to hire people that speaking eighty five percent of English. Mm -hmm. or they said 80. 85 or 90 um but they will test you okay there are a lot of tests that you have to do for example listening test uh to check if you have good listening comprehension also reading okay also they they evaluate your computer skills like if you are good at typing um maybe this this uh review uh, the tenses maybe the past tense okay grammar and they mm -hmm. yes oh, they well. also check grammar in the test so, okay and also there's like the searching skills that you have uh, they will give you like different scenarios look for this and this and you have to go to google and look for that right um mm. What else? Uh, in the interviews, um, okay. that is the first filter, the first interview that is by human resources. Then there mm -hmm. is another interview by the manager of the account that you will work for. And um, yeah, sometimes just two interviews or, or three, right? It depends on the account that you are going okay. to apply for. What because is the account more easy? There are a lot of accounts. They, okay, there are a lot of accounts related with health, 
okay, health insurance, uh, cars insurance, life insurance, everything mm -hmm. related to insurances, right? Okay. Uh -huh. Also related to cell phones. Okay. Related to video games. Oh, nice. Uh -huh. Related to banks, banks accounts that you need mm. to know. Uh, you need to know a lot of information about banks. Uh, um, this case, uh, I can say terminology, bank mm -hmm. terminology. Okay, uh, law and interests, yeah. three years, three years ago, weeks. Yeah, everything mm -hmm. about that. Also, customer service for different products. So, for example, it could be customer service for a service that they provide. Uh, it could be like a uh, website support. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, nice. there are there are a lot of uh kind of um line of business. But I imagine that we need to uh study topic specific when mm. the count is difficult. The most important for them to hire you hire hire you, okay, is that you have a good level of English. Ah, okay. Because Bait. Because you will be able to learn about the product, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. They will give you a training. Ah, okay. Okay, good. Number one, we're going to do the homework now. Number one. Okay, the way someone act. Which one is that? Mm -hmm. Behavior. Behavior. Okay, good. The action of crime of stealing. <laughs> the okay. Now you. So we F. don't. We don't forget that. Okay. F. Theft. Very good. Theft. Yes. Very good. The amount of money paid to an employee. Wage. Wage. Maybe. Wage. 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 Okay. Something that causes fear or nervousness. Spooky. Spooky. Okay. To remove someone's doubts or fears. Reaction. 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 Okay. Very good. Very good. Now send it. There you have it. Okay, so that is everything that you have to do with this. Just it was about vocabulary. Okay, very good, good job. So we're still working on this. Let me see. I have received one, two, three, four, six, six only. What about the rest? Maria Leticia, Julio, Daniela, Lady. Rodrigo and Carlos. Okay, we are missing the one for Gilberto. Roberto Carlos. Okay, Hola. Gilberto. Thank you so much, Gilberto. Okay, Silvia, Daniela, Andres, Katy, William Roque, Sofia, and Mauricio Benavides. All of you, okay? Please be care uh, make sure that you send it guys for Monday. And please work on the on on the platform if you have activities pending. Okay. I hope that you enjoy tomorrow. Okay. Um rest in your house. Yeah, yes. If you go out, be careful. Okay. Take care. Hey teacher. Thank you. Have a good, Thank you, teacher. good long weekend. Thank you. Thank Enjoy you, it all. Thank you. Thank you so much. Have Take a care. good night. Good night. Have a good night. Bye bye. Take bye -bye. care. Bye. Good, Take night. Care. <clears throat> good night. Bye bye. Good night. Enjoy. Independence. Yes. You too.
Happy, Ind Happy Independence Day. Vayan a marchar mañana. <laughs>